Hey guys, what's going on? It's your man Charred Virgin here, here with some Minecraft uh, gameplay, I guess. It's not very much, I'm just uh, building the house in my little city with me and my friends are playing on. Maybe in the future I'll do a couple Let's Plays, me and my buddies will fool around and do some stuff in there. So far I'm just getting the houses down. Anyways, that's besides the point. Today what I wanted to talk about was World War II. Now... Disclaimer, people are all like, oh, World War II, oh my god, oh, I can come here for a history lesson. It's not necessarily that, it's kind of a rant, because what I want to talk about is Germans in particular. Because I am German myself, my family comes from Germany. No, we're not Nazis, because we were gone after World War One. We were in between. We kind of came over to New York during the Great Depression and all that stuff. Anyways, um, but yeah, basically I want to talk about what happened. So, in World War II, obviously, Hitler became Chancellor and all that stuff. He started creating, be able to create his own laws. And, you know, he was able to overthrow Jews and, like, the government. He was the government, basically. And he was able to kill many Jews during the Holocaust, as well as do a great, a sustainable amount of damage during, the World War, during World War II itself during all the fights and the battles. And uh, when they retreated, you know, it made it made quite an image. It made quite a negative image on us, which I don't think is very good, obviously. Um, but, and they say that every German is evil. People think that we're not nice people, that we're not friendly, we're not the happy, you know, shy some of the high. You know, we th they think we're like, nine to show fine! You know, like, just, like, angry, aggressive, screaming people that just want to kill everything. That just want to kill everybody. Because that's just the way we are. I don't know. But that's not really what we're about. We're, like, we're just happy, poke music loving uh, sausage makers. Ha ha ha. Gay jokes. Gay jokes below. Ha ha. Anyways. And it's just, I don't know. I think, I think from what that did, from what Hitler did, from what a Holocaust did to us, wasn't necessarily a good thing. And just because we are not, uh, just because that one person made such a difference on our behalf does not mean that we're all like that. I'm not like that. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm not willing, I'm not willing enough to kill a whole bunch of people like that. I'm not willing to I'm I'm aggressive and I'm get mad sometimes, but I don't think I have the capabilities of actually whining of hating that person enough to actually go out and kill every single type of that person. You know, like I may talk, but I may joke, but I'm just joking. It's not real, and and I think I think people need to see the goodness. Like there's a lot of negativity. When people talk about Germans, as soon as we talk about Germans, as, as soon as that topic, as soon as that country is brought up, immediately it's just taken into this deep hellhole of just negativity and just, oh, the, you know, the Germans did this and that, and they killed all the Jews, and, you know, they hate the Jews, and World War One and World War Two, and they just wanted to conquer everybody. No. It's not necessarily how it worked. See. There was one guy from for for both world wars. There's one guy or a small group of people that just wanted to kill people. That just wanted more power. Wanted more power. We we thought our we our country's great. When you think about it, we gave you Einstein. We gave you the scorpions. We gave you a bunch of stuff. We made hot dogs. We invented hot dogs, guys. Like, come on, give us some credit. And you know that's where it all comes down to, like one guy and or and or a, a small group of people just thought that hey our country is great why don't we have more power why don't we get more space why don't we start conquering some of this land and make ourselves a greater empire and that's just where it all came from that's just where it all went that's where that's the essential uh, vitality of it all that's where it all based upon that idea and Obviously, it turns out the way it did. It turns out into negativity and all this unexpected stuff you wouldn't see anywhere else. And, you know, it's not the first time. It's not the first time uh, 
genocide has occurred. You know, there's other there's other instances. Rwanda, for example. Right? The Rwanda genocide from Tutsis and Hutus. Right? That's another thing. Anyways, um and another thing was that like we're uh we're very smart. We're very smart people. And I'm not like trying to toot my own heart here. I'm not trying to say oh I'm a genius. I'm smart. But I'm sure there's other people in the world that are smarter than me. Asians, for example. Now I'm going to get a little racist. Sorry about that. But Asian people, of course, I know. I know because there are Asian people in my school that are smarter than me. And I don't know if I, I could ever accomplish what they could. I don't think I can ever be as smart as they are. But um, there's a lot of things having to do with our image today. And hopefully there's some German people in my audience. There's hopefully hopefully there's some German people who watch my videos. I think a few people have seen them, have my videos. A few German people. And I hope you start watching them more because, unfortunately, I don't speak German. But there are quite a few of us that speak English. And hopefully they'll start watching my stuff. And they'll see what, you know, what we're all about. They'll be like, yes, so many people all their lives have said that... We are this evil person. Just, no, you're a Nazi. And, like, just, you're hateful and you're full of hate. You want to kill people. No, that's not what we're about. And it's, I don't know, I've just been, I through all, a lot of my life, I've been told that I'm a Nazi just because I'm a little bit racist. And everyone's racist. You know, that's not, that's not an uncommon thing. Racist, to be racist. Now, I'm sure there are a lot of people that aren't racist in this world. Those call, those are called religious people. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, like, I'm white. I'm white. I gotta face reality. I'm racist. White people are racist. That's just the way, I guess, it kind of is. It doesn't have to be that way. I'm not trying to promote racism. I'm not trying to say, be racist. But, like, I'm racist. But I'm also racist against myself. And when it comes down to it, when you're making fun of another race... If you're just making fun of another race and you're not like saying, "Oh, but my country, my my race is bad too," then then it's not okay. But if you're but like when I do it, I say, "Oh, you know, black people were slaves, and you know, but I killed a bunch of Jewish people." So how great am I, you know? And I think when it comes down to racism, that's just the way it has to work. I well, not has to work. Sorry, I shouldn't say that, but um. I think that's one way it can balance out, and that's that's one way everyone can get their share, everyone can get their own view or opinion of it, and I don't know, you know, like, and one 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 way I can see that is um, is this week we've been reading the book Romeo and Juliet, the play Romeo and Juliet by William Shakespeare. Uh, if you're in high school, you or were in high school, you probably read it. It's about you know two people falling in love. From two different families, from Capulets, for which is the family that Juliet is from, and Montagues, which is the family that Romeo is from. And what happens is Romeo and Juliet fall in love, and no one really knows about it. And the two families forever, forever and ever and ever, they've been fighting. And it's just, and everyone sees, and all the Capulets see Montagues as evil people, even though they didn't really do anything. And Montagues see Capulets. As evil people, even though they really didn't do anything, because it's coming from a long, long line of evil, evilness. And it's just of something of something that happened years and years before, beforehand. And I'm sure they don't even know what happened. They just know that they hate each other, and they're having a fight. And really, when it comes when that's the way it works now nowadays, that is how racism is nowadays. You know, we just we still remember we remember all the bad things but we still hate them for it even though it happened a long time ago and it doesn't and doesn't directly correlate with that person individually with that individual itself like i'm not hitler i'm not related to hitler i'm not related to a nazi and yet i'm called out for that just like uh you know just like Romeo isn't the Montague that started the fight or was part of the fight originally. And he's from he might he is indeed from a lot from a line of them, but he's not trying to be mean to the Capulets. He doesn't want to. 
just like Benvolio, his cousin, he's trying to keep the peace in between the families. He's trying to be nice. He's trying to make sure people are being nice to each other and not fighting too much. And that's just, and that's, I think, the way uh, people see it now. They're just like, oh, well, they just assume. They make assumptions, and they think that just because it's that per that one in particular person means they did something bad. And, or that they're part of the problem, or that they're part of this whole generalization. And they're not. Which kind of comes down to what I do. I make fun of I make fun of racism. I make fun of Asians. I can, I make fun of black people. I make fun of Spanish people. I make fun of Italian people. I make fun of English people. I make fun of lots of people. And I'm not exactly, you know, I'm, you know, I'm, I don't, I find it's just funny. I think we can just laugh at this stuff. I, tr I treat it that way. I treat it like, oh, you know, you guys are slaves. Oh, <laughs> give me a beer. Oh, <laughs> that's funny, right? It's like, if you can just joke about it. That's how I try to put it in my life. I try to just joke about it and just be funny. And then, you know, and then, but at the same time, I'm going, oh, can you get a, you know, get one, get a beer for the Jew killer over here, you know, just like, it's, it's just something we can just all laugh about, it's just something, obviously we remember that they weren't necessarily happy events in, in our society, but at the same time, they weren't, they don't, they don't need to affect us now, still, we can, if we, we can still be like, funny about it, we can still talk about, you know, racism and stuff like that, we can still be racist, kind of, but in the sense that we're joking about it, that we're not being literal, that we're not, you know, we're not being hateful, we're not, we're just being nice to each other, we're just joking about it, we're just like, hey, you know, our two, our two kinds of people have the same, uh, thing, we, we both made fun of the first thing, but, so we just, we, let's just joke about it, let's just make it a joke in between us, you know, it's like, that's, that's what I think racism should become, and, you know, and that's, I, that's the way I see it. I don't know. Tell me, tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Um, uh, I told you guys I was gonna be doing some Minecraft videos. So far, I think I, I have this one, and I have another one uh, that came out earlier, I believe, or later. And it's uh, just a funny little thing, funny thing with me and my friend Liam. We were talking about. I don't know. I think I was having one of my craziness. Uh, moments and I was just talking but we were just talking about random things it's kind of funny uh forgive the audio in that video like because I my voice is really loud I was using my other microphone it was really pop it was really like poppy and whatever it's not exactly as good and Liam wasn't quite being that loud so it's kind of difficult to hear him in that but forgive me because uh you know I do what I can I try to do what I can and so, um, yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I'm sorry it's a little long and it's not exactly that entertaining, but I'm hoping you guys take my opinion regardless. Uh, I hope I hear some, some of your feedback on this, uh, on this topic because I want to know. I want to know what you guys think of racism. I want to know, you know, what you guys think of tell me your opinion tell me your experiences give me some of your give me some of your stories you know i want to know i want since my my channel is small guys my channel is really small and if you guys are watching my videos and you guys are liking my stuff and you guys want to contact me you guys want to talk to me about stuff let me know like my stuff i don't care well you don't know i'm not i'm not trying to force it upon you but i'd like it if you guys could you know comment at least just if you go if you think about something go hey i you know I can. I have a similar experience. I I agree with them. I totally think that racism should be a th shouldn't should be a thing that should be just joked about. It shouldn't be taken as serious, and we should just be able to get along and kind of bond over it. It's something that we should use to bond over. If you think that or something like or anything like that, or you have your own experience, like hey, he was talking about uh, how him and his friends you know make jokes about racism. I do that too. Maybe I should just. That's kind of neat. Put that in the comments. I want to know. I want to know your stories. I want to know. I want to know what you think of my videos. I want to know what you think of the quality of my videos. I want to know about what you think about the length of my videos, um, the games that I'm playing, uh, the topics I'm talking about. Give me some topics, because uh, it's you know sometimes it gets a little difficult for me to 
think of stuff to talk about. And, uh, you know, uh, I hope you guys, uh, give me lots of feedback, give me lots, give me some likes, I really don't care about likes too much, just, I hope, I'm glad that you guys are watching my videos, uh, I'll still be uploading regardless, I don't care if my videos don't get views right now, because it's very small, and, uh, I think I'm not really expecting a whole lot out of my YouTube channel until I get to, like, until I upload a lot more, until I get maybe around 100 vid videos out, when I get to around 100, because right now I think I'm at about 20 almost, and uh, once I get a lot more out, I think it'll work a lot better for me, I'll be seeing a lot more traffic on my channel, and everything will be a lot better, so uh, yeah, again, subscribe, please, subscribe to my uh, channel if you like all my stuff, if you're watching all my videos, and uh, keep you posted on all the new stuff that comes out. Uh, like my Facebook page, I have a Facebook page now, I will be, uh, definitely notifying all the people when my videos are coming out on that page and all the other stuff that I'm planning on doing. Uh, you can kind of follow me on Twitter, I really don't go on Twitter that much, I really don't care very much. But, um, yeah, like, leave a like on this video, leave a comment on this video, please, if you watch it, leave a comment, I, I'd love it a lot. And, uh, yeah, give me some topics, you know, give me your feedback, love your feedback. And uh, I will see you guys next time. See you in about a week or so. See you guys. Have a great weekend slash week. And I will see you next time. Peace.